right, today, Nina, we're going to look at a page in the foot book. This is a great book. It's, it's really a fun book filled with a lot of techniques. But this is double needle stitching with foot number 20. And one of the things I like about double needle stitching is that you can do both practical and decorative work. And you can see on the page we have some decorative uh, double needle stitching. And at the bottom there's a, a nice little hem that you can do on knit fabric using a double needle. I love the double needle on knits. And what I like about the double needle is that you really sew like you always sew. Once you get the machine set up, you're ready to go and you just sew a straight line but you get something unique and what we're going to look at today is stitching ribbon with a double needle you can stitch any type of ribbon and what you're looking for is a double needle that is about the same width as your ribbon and that way you can stitch it so that it goes right down each edge you only have to do one pass and it's perfect parallel stitching I remember sewing with eighth inch ribbon with the real narrow needles and it's absolutely perfect. Yes, they come in a lot of different sizes starting at 1.6 millimeter going all the way up to 8 millimeter. And when you get to the wider ones you have to have a machine that will take that width. But most of them you can use on almost any machine. You're going to love this. Let me show you how easy it is. Now you can see that I have two spools of thread, one in each needle, and you really thread the machine just like you always do except you separate the threads right before they go into the needle. One goes in the guide and one bypasses the guide. And I've selected a needle that is slightly less wide than the width of the ribbon. So what I'm getting are two parallel rows of stitching right down each side of the ribbon. So it's just a beautiful finish, very easy to do, and you only have to stitch the ribbon one time so it's much quicker than going down each side separately. The foot I'm using is open embroidery foot number 20, which is perfect because I can see exactly where I'm, I'm stitching. And we have other feet options as well. Yes, you do. We have wider feet. This is the uh, open embroidery foot 20D for the 8 series and open embroidery foot 20C for our models that do a 9 millimeter stitch with. These are great options for the models that have wider stitch width. You can use wider needles and stitch on wider ribbon. Now let's take a look and see what we've done here. We have perfect parallel stitching so it makes a beautiful finish for this ribbon and it's faster. It looks wonderful. This is just one of the fun techniques in the foot book. I love my foot book. It's a project that you can find on the Bernina USA website. If you like mixed media sewing and scrapbooking, you're going to love putting together these pages. They're filled with techniques that the Bernina Presser Feet will do and you get to practice all those techniques and build yourself a piece of art at the same time. For more fun techniques like this, visit your local Bernina dealer today.